I wanted to make another tutorial video because recently my Streets of Rage 2 hacks videos have been blowing up with comments about people asking me how exactly are you supposed to go about installing these mods and how to use them so I'm gonna make this video to show you guys exactly how to do it. So the first thing you're gonna want is the Sega Mega Drive Classics on Steam and I believe it's free. Ignore the, the package because it'll say $30, but that's only for the package. Just get the game and you should be able to get it for free. After that, you want to get Streets of Rage 2 or any other game you're trying to mod. The games cost $2 each. And once you have that, you want to come over to the workshop. So after you come here, you'll see a list of mods. Um, for all the games that you can choose. You can search up here, you could type in Streets of Rage 2 and then a lot of the hacks for the Streets of Rage 2 games will come up. So I'm going to just choose one. Here's the tick. So you can just hit subscribe and now the mod is installed in your game. Now you go to library and you play the second Mega Drives Classics. Start it up. Okay, so once you're in here, you want to scroll over to your library and then you want to select the game, highlight the game that, that you installed a mod for. Then press Y to go to mods and then all the mods that you installed will appear right here. So now I can scroll down until I find what I installed, which was the tick. As you can see, I have a whole bunch of mods in here. And there you go. And then just press A or enter if you're on keyboard and then it should start up. And there we go. And so yeah, that's it. I uh, hope this video helped you guys out. If it did, leave a like, subscribe if you want, and that's it. Peace.